The top dogs in SoCal stepped up to take their turn at the Dislocator Wad, aptly named after the carnage from the team event. This workout was going to test some of the fittest men in the world and in the process, possibly eliminate some athletes from the field. In the final event, Kenneth Leverage and John Para, both of Orange Coast CrossFit, were competing side by side. Leverage jumped out to a slight lead over Para during the heat, but Para was able to close the gap on Leverage going into the final round of the dumbbell snatches, and the two finished their final snatches and a sprint in unison. They would finish in a three-way tie for second place with Ronnie Teasdale with a time of 3.53. But the workout belonged to Dave Lipson of CrossFit Invictus. Lipson absolutely balled the weight, making the 100-pound dumbbell look like a toy. He was relaxed throughout his entire heat and led from start to finish. Lipson quickly separated himself from the pack and crushed the workout with a final time of 3.46. After three events, John Para is your leader with 11 points, Kenneth Leverage is just two points back in second, and 42-year-old Bill Grunzler rounds out the top three after a 10th place finish in event number three.